Hey guys, TGIS. Thank God it's Saturday. All right, you're going to love, feel better after listening to this. I heard this quite a few times for the past few days and really trying to understand what kind of blocks I am dealing with. This audio just keeps me getting inspired each time I listen to it. The ending is really, really great talking about 50 Cent rapper. I hope you do know him. And I believe that some of you may have got their soulmate sketch. Well, make your dreams come true. Wishing an awesome day and a nice weekend. Enjoy and chill. That, I guess my frustration comes from knowing all of this and still not being able to... You know what your discord says to us? Yes. No, I don't. <laughs> What your discord says to us is, he knows this. No, you have no idea how much I know this. He, I, oh, we have every no. idea how much. We have every idea. You have no idea how much we know. No. But hear this, no, no, hear I, this, because we don't want you to make light of this. We, we really want you to hear what we just said to you. When you say, I have discord, we say, yes. He has discord because he has carved out something that is beyond what he is currently allowing himself to live fully. Yeah. And we would far rather that you have the discord of that than the lethargy of no desire that is not being denied. It is nice. so much better to have desire that you're working yourself into alignment with than no desire because you are truly alive when you have desire. You will never hear us say, we want you to live only in positive emotion because we want you to mix it up. We want you to do what you came to do. We want you to be on the leading edge. You are the pioneer for the new expanded thought. We just don't want you to keep creating new expanded thoughts and holding back from them. And you don't want it either. That's what this whole conversation is about. I don't want that. And we don't want you to try to define what's holding you back anymore. We want you to begin saying, ah, I'm holding myself back. I'm getting better and better at it. Life is supposed to be fun. I smile at least once a day. Things are going pretty well for me. I'm understanding this more and more every day. And then just keep watching how much law of attraction will bring to you the evidence of your ever evolving progress you guys have no idea but as as <laughs> this is that see i like empirical what, what is it they have no idea i like empirical data but you're literally sitting there talking about the question that the next question that i'm going to say just I'll, just please leave me with this so that i can go back to new york and and not scream at the computer or the cd player or the mp3 player so well scream at it the but then question. listen to what comes after I know right that's, that's the thing when yes. you scream we hear and we don't hold it against you that you're screaming at us we hear the power of your question and when you scream your question we hear it but you've got to relax before you can hear our response yes. and my actual question just so they know was how do I how do leave me with some relief about all of the the things that didn't happen in the past because that's really that remorse is what's building more than anything else in my right. in my consciousness so many promises and broken promises to myself and missed goals and things like that obviously that's not alignment and obviously that's my hand on the stove your vortex is full yes. of the beneficial results of the passion of those experiences and as they come into fruition you will recognize the relationship between what you are right now calling a broken promise and the fantastic fulfillment of promises that are so big that you have not been able to see them fully in other words your vortex is full of the beneficial results of what you are calling failed attempts your vortex is full it is the basis of expansion but the only reason you're feeling regret about it remorse is because you have anger not, is because you have not yet allowed yourself to receive the fulfillment of what it all put there we're looking for an analogy that that feels enough off the subject that can you can hear it clearly so you have an intention for something but 
you didn't know about aligning energy and you so you weren't and you were giving it everything you had because you believed that action was the way and you were working hard to accomplish things relationship things financial things life things from a split energy perspective and in that that but even in that split energy you were putting things into the vortex that you were denying as you went along so ask but don't let it in 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 but here's where we came into the picture that gave you new understanding ask put it in the vortex but don't go in where it is ask put it in the vortex but don't go in where it is so all of that asking and not receiving right then that red hot minute you're calling failed attempts we're calling it putting stuff in the vortex it's not a failed attempt unless you never go in the vortex and there's no possible way that you will not ever go in the vortex because even in what you call your death experience oh you're going in I, I don't like when you say that we know you don't I don't like that I and I and it well then don't relief. wait till then to go in <laughs> don't wait till then to go in we just we're just we're just not gonna tell you different than it is we're gonna tell you that you've been putting it in and the fact that you haven't yet found your way to resonate with it doesn't mean that it doesn't exist and doesn't mean that you've failed and and when we see a blossoming vortex like the one that you've created we see only success 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 because it's only those who mix it up and care who do something like that and then oh the the jubilation in the revelation as you allow yourself to resonate with it so now what you're saying is okay I can even sort of follow that I can even accept that maybe I've put it there but what's taking me so long to get in there and we say you're you're like a lot of people in that you're still sifting you're still sorting you're still knowing what you don't want and knowing what you do want but you have not yet made the decision that nothing is more important than that you feel good that's the only thing that's missing you haven't decided that you care more about feeling good than receiving the benefit of the things that you think you've been asking for brings me to the final question the success that you're looking for isn't the financial money although it will come the success that you're looking for is the harmony you feel when you let yourself finally be up to speed with all that you have become so I come from New York City there are a hundred thousand successful people in a 20 block radius not happy I didn't say happy I said then success. they're not successful right You're if they're not in a lot they're not successful okay they're not successful go to their go to a different seminar where you learn about how to make money okay because here we can teach you about how to be successful and once you click into that then everything else will follow okay so I'm just most most likely you're just gonna say I'm I'm paying attention or focusing on the wrong values and they're oh, different from what not, I want we're not saying that to you so. because if you were focusing on the wrong values you wouldn't feel the discord that you're feeling gotcha. the discord you're feeling means you're right spot on about what matters so I meditate a lot more than the rapper 50 cent for example <laughs> and I do well, a lot more focus we than happen him. to know that's not true that is a flawed premise because he meditates while he raps because understand that when we talk about meditation we're talking about alignment the reason that we teach people to meditate is because frankly it's easier to teach them to have no thought than to have pure positive thought but someone whose energy is not split which sometimes happens in meditation when someone's appreciating they're not splitting their energy either and when someone is performing when someone is performing in that place of alignment that's what you're reaching for you see you need to rap about the stock market hold on hold on hold on no 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 I I'm not I am not a hired actor I promise you this has, I have nothing to do with these people at the, the 
one and a half seconds before you said, go rap, I said, so then just tell me to go rap. In my mind. And it answers my question. So, Do the so what, so what, we're, what we're giving you here is, Done. so you are receiving the inspiration. Yes. You are in the vortex now. Right this here, is right what now. it I'm feels in. like to be yes. tuned in, tapped in, turned on. But I feel like this a lot. I, I, do, I feel like this. I, I know when a vortex is. I, I see it. I know yes. performers are in the vortex. I know you're in the vortex because it's the confidence. It's forward feeling. It's awesome. It's, ah, who cares? It's, I'm, I'm over here. I'm playing my own drum set. I don't care what you're saying. So I feel like this a lot. Yes, you do. But, but it, I don't see the stuff. Well, here's the thing that we... And I don't look at it thing, every day. Here's the piece that we five started... five months later, I'm like... Hey, I just spent five months feeling way too, like that. That's what way happened? too long. That's way too long. Right. Uh, here's what right. we... Here, here, You're here, right. Here's what... And that's four years since I heard your first thing. Here's what we started to tell you before we got into the conversation about the rappers. And you're going to really appreciate this because okay. this is the piece that you're looking for. When you are in alignment with who you are and you're feeling the flow of that, that's what you're always reaching for. In other words, if you will just replay as often as you can the sensations that were so vivid and real that we experienced here together just now as you find that feeling place you'll practice the vibration of that and more things like that will occur for you in other words this was just a powerful meeting of the minds it was a powerful blending of energy and what we want to say to you in the same way that you rendezvoused with us here in the vortex you were lighted up over there with the power of your question I did that on purpose well it was obvious to us it was obvious to us you were lighted up over there with the power of your question and just bringing you forth is a conf confirmation to you that's why that, I said I that, nailed it that when, when I said that. That that when you set your mind to something and don't offer split energy about it that all forces move toward the uh, the accomplishment of it and that's the piece that we want you to take away from this but don't take score about when it is unfolding instead go into the general place of trusting that it is unfolding and say things to yourself such as I so look forward to the continuum of surprise and delight as the universe gives me constant evidence of my alignment the alignment that I am continually seeking and stop beating up on yourself in the moments that you are aware that you don't have alignment because the awareness that you don't have alignment is necessary for the awareness that you do have alignment you see what we're getting at they are equally beneficial emotions they're equally beneficial now that's a really general really good source energy statement because source would say to you source is saying to you you came forth into this physical body to mix it up and to know what you don't want in order to know what you do want and you cannot know what you do want if you do not know what you don't want they are equal parts in this moving forward just don't be too heavy-handed in the beating the drum of what you don't want in order to create what you do want there's enough in your vortex to keep you happily busy for 20 or 30 lifetimes this is the time for you this is the time for you to practice and know and feel and revel in the alignment that you have just tasted just now but when you're not having it don't worry about it because your placeholder is never going to get tired of holding the place for you your placeholder is never for a moment disappointed in anything that you are doing your placeholder the larger part of you and all that we are that stand in full knowledge of who you really are will never feel a moment's disappointment or discouragement about anything that you are and when you feel it you have diverged from what we all know about you so cut it out <laughs>